Here we have a 2018 Mac Mini that came in for the classic problem, which is a damaged fan connector. What's new? What's new with this model? 2018 Mac Mini. Every single one that we get in our shop here has a damaged fan connector. Usually what happens is the user opens up the computer so they can upgrade the RAM and you have to remove the fan connector first before you can take the board out. You end up either ripping the fan connector or ripping pads off the board. I do not know what's going on here. Customer said that we should not have any ripped pads because if we do, it may be a problem for this model. You cannot trace where the pads are going to on the board. And let me show you quick, right there, right here. We have all six pads and we have the two supporting pads down on the bottom, one on the left and one on the right. So we have this, we have this, one, two, three, four, five, six. Great. Let's proceed without wasting any time. And I need to clean that flux tip. It's been through a lot of Hiroshima's and a lot of wars. Let's check right now. How is that looking? Back like new. And let's use this soldering tip to just quickly remove those and get rid of the glare. If you want to fix your hair or if you're a lady, you want to do your makeup, you can see yourself with those joints. Let's use our wig to clean up and desolder so the connector can sit flush with the board and then we can apply solder. And here we have a new fan connector. What I want to do is apply some adhesive on the back. I usually like to do that so we can secure it down in place even more. Just a tiny bit. Now when I push it down, the glue is going to spread. And that connector is going to be better than factory. Let's check here. Move it just a tiny bit to the side. Press down and tell me that's not nice. Now I don't have to worry about the connector, it's not gonna move anywhere. We're gonna start with the front pins. It's gonna be hard to get to those pins on here, and that's why we have the glue. Why are you using a lot of flux? Why not? Nice and gentle. You're right there. The customer just came in with a 2019 iMac, 27 inch. He replaced the hard drive and the computer worked afterwards. But after two weeks, he heard a big boom and the screen fell off, it broke. He replaced the screen and now he's not getting any image or backlight on the screen. We have it here. Maybe we'll work on it in a future video. We'll see. But let's check on our fan connector and see what's going on. The guy has been watching our channel for maybe a month, he said.
So how do we know if the soldering is good? You must be able to fix your hair looking at the joints. That's how you know if the soldering is good. Look at this. Right now we have a lot of stuff on the board. That's what happens when you are working with a dark board. It's hard to see. It's a contrast between black and white, liquid and dark board. When we are working with a blue board or green board, it looks a lot better under the microscope. We're all good. We're going to reassemble the fan, reassemble the computer. The customer got the computer in like this. The screws, the fan, Wi-Fi, and all that stuff. We're going to have to reassemble it, call the customer to come and pick up, and the job is done. Once the fan is plugged in, that fan is not going to go anywhere. It's solid forever, unless the customer opens up the computer and he wants to do more work, upgrade the RAM or whatever the case may be, then he has to be careful when removing that connector. A safe way to do it would be to press down on the connector and pull up on the fan. Because even a factory connector will break off if you put a lot of pressure pulling up the fan. Hey, is it on? Yes. No matter what it is. Oh, it's not spinning. Okay. You need to turn it on. Yes. The fan is working. And we're done. So we're going to end the video right here. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave a comment if you have any questions. If you have questions not relating to this repair, you can leave it on our forums, log in to northbridgefix.com, click on forum, you can ask your questions, I will answer you whenever I have time. It's not guaranteed that I will answer you immediately, but whenever I have time, I check the forum, unanswered questions, and I try to help out. We have a lot of smart people on the forum also that may be able to help you out or answer your questions, and that's it. I will see you again in the next video.